where are you right now in terms of your recovery? Uh, you know, it's coming along. I mean, obviously, uh, it's, it's a long, slow process. And uh, like I said, today is my first day on the ice, so I'm just going to take it uh, take it day by day. And uh, obviously, I didn't shoot any pucks today. I was just kind of doing some passing. So Wait, is it, it was four to six months. Right. Yeah, yeah. And it's not still on target? Uh, you know, I'm hoping so. So um, I guess with this, it's something that, uh, you know, going into it, you knew it was going to be a long, drawn-out process. So um, I'm just trying to take it, uh, you know, day by day. I guess the biggest challenge is mentally, like getting over the hump. Uh, you don't really know where it's going to be until all of a sudden you kind of wake up one day and it's starting to feel a little better and better and better. So uh, I guess just mentally, just, it's my first time ever having surgery. So uh, just getting over that hump is... Uh, uh, probably the big thing for me. This was your first time on the ice, you said? Yeah, it's my first time uh, since since August. Uh, I didn't really feel the injury at all over the summer, and then um, you know, hopped back on the ice in August, and, and I felt it. So um, it was something that it was an injury that you can't just stick your hand on an X-ray machine and, and diagnose it. So it took a lot of a lot of a long process to, to figure out what was wrong, and. Um, you know, like I said, the organization was, was great with me the whole time. Is the slap shot that's going to be kind of hard to get back with the wrist? Or? I'm not sure. I guess I'll find out. But as far as right now, I just did passes today. So um, that's something I'm sure I'll, I'll find out in, in the near future, hopefully.